hello everyone welcome back to my channel today i am going to be budgeting out my fourth paycheck of november and um i just want to say i apologize you guys i have been super busy i've been super stressed over my finals but they're finally over <laughs> my finals are finally over and um I opened up my shop again and I do want to let you guys know I have some new stuff coming out and um, I will be participating in Black Friday uh, I will be having a sale on my shop so um, I'm gonna have this sale I believe starting Monday to Friday so all week um, so look out for that oh, sorry about that you guys I live in the city <laughs> that is the city for you guys um, Okay, so let's start budgeting out my paycheck. Um, okay, so for this week, I made $1,422. $1,422. Let me get my calculator. see if you guys can see that can you guys see that you guys can see that okay okay so I made a one thousand four hundred and twenty two dollars and um, so we're gonna do this on paycheck number four um, I do budget out 350 for my rent so I have a thousand seventy two left um, as you can see everything's been paid off for the month of November um, I am going to put $200 aside for my credit cards because, um, I did buy something for my mom on my credit card and I need to pay it off. And then, um, groceries, I am not going to put anything aside for groceries only because we just went grocery shopping, like maybe like two days ago. So we have plenty of groceries and I don't think I'm going to need any this week. So nothing for groceries. For gas, I am going to put 160 because this week I do work. And for spending, I am going to put $50 because, I don't know, anyone else have this where you are shopping for people for Christmas and then you just want to buy everything for yourself too? Or is it just me because I feel like... <laughs> I don't know like I go to the store and I'm like I want this I want this I want this oh yeah I could buy this for my mom but I want this and I want this and I end up buying myself more than I do other people it's crazy but um on the other hand I did start Christmas shopping already so um yeah I'm almost almost done I just have to get something for my dad and maybe a few more gifts for the kids and um yeah after that i will be pretty much done okay so let me so 1422 minus 350 minus 200 minus 160 minus 50 we are left with 662 dollars for my envelopes all right, so let's go ahead and distribute that. Let me find the page. Can you guys see that? I'm trying to get it to where you guys can see the calculator too. Okay, all right, so $662. Give me one second because I wrote some notes on how much I need in some of the categories because some of them are preset. So, all right. Okay, so for Sway, which is my son, he is going to get $40 this week. My car registration is going to be getting nothing i forgot this one's already fully funded for next year um my car insurance is going to be getting 60 dollars so minus 40 minus 60. christmas is going to be getting 20 dollars 
and like I said anything that I don't use this year for Christmas um, I will be using for I will be rolling it over for next year um, but I have used I believe almost like six hundred dollars of my Christmas fund already so um, I don't think there will be anything left over but we shall see um, for vacation I'm gonna put $40 Um, for investing, we are going to put uh, $50. For a home, I'm going to put $20. For emergency fund, I'm going to put $50. All right. Um, I'm not going to put anything for retirement. And a month ahead is going to get $50. My car maintenance is going to get $40. And medical is not going to get anything. I got to redo this thing because there's two of them that I completely took off of here and I don't know. They need to be off. <laughs> Couponing. Um, I didn't put anything towards couponing. Uh, laundry is going to get its usual 20. Momo and Demon, which are my cats, they are going to get $40. Uh, giveaways, I'm going to put $12 in there. Um, buffer is not going to get anything and neither is rent. Alright, my 2K challenge is going to get... um two hundred dollars because that's what i had scratched off last week and uh that leaves me at twenty dollars um why did i not put money in oh supplies i put twenty dollars in supplies which equals zero let's calculate sorry you guys i am in my pajamas as you guys can see I bought me and my fiance matching onesies, and um, I bought the doggy one too, and we're all matching. <laughs> we're already in the Christmas spirit, you guys, and we're all matching. We all have matching onesies, which is really, really cute. Um, but, okay, let's uh, see what denominations I need. And um, today's story, you guys, it's a very short one. Um, I watched it and I guess it just happened recently this year so they really don't have much on it but I did like hear the background from 10 to life from Annie Elise and uh, I don't know like the more I watch these the more I wonder what is going on like what is going on with people what is really going on in their heads or like how are they capable of doing the things they do you know it's it's freaking crazy um but okay let's let's break it down and then i'll tell you guys the story it's a little short story but it's crazy sway can get 220s car insurance can get 320s christmas can get 120 vacation can get 220s investing can get 220s and two fives home can get 120 emergency fund can get 220s and two fives and month ahead can get 220s and two fives all right, so the story is this lady shows up in, she shows up to the hospital and she goes up to one of the nurses and she's like, hey, you know, my daughter, her body hurts. Can you get a wheelchair and help me get her out of the car? So the lady goes with a wheelchair to the car, but what she finds is not a kid that's body hurts. She finds the lady's daughter wrapped up in a plastic bag, pretty much motionless, you know? And when the lady turned the daughter around, the daughter had a slit in her throat. Um, yeah, so where she got that her daughter's body hurt and she needed a wheelchair, I don't know. But um, when they had interrogated her, she had initially confessed that her daughter... She, she okay so basically she said she had to do it because her daughter was evil and she said that she went to the park and in the park she went and 
slit her daughter's throat from behind her. So she went up to her daughter from behind and she slit her throat. And that the last words the daughter had said to her was, but mommy, I've been good. Oh my God, it breaks my heart. And um, so she said that her daughter did not die fast enough. So what she did was ended up strangling her daughter for 30 to 45 minutes while she was in that bag. She put a plastic bag over her and strangled her for 30 to 45 minutes, essentially killing her. And, um, and they don't know what happened after, like how she got into the car or why she drove to the hospital saying that her daughter's body hurt. You know, like it just, it makes no sense. Demon. Sorry, you guys, my cat. So we put up our Christmas tree and we put up like the ornaments, right? And we intentionally didn't put the ornaments too low so the cats wouldn't get to it because you guys know how cats are. But now my cats are trying to climb the tree to get the ornaments. Oh my gosh. They've been successful on dropping a few and playing with them like they're toys. Anybody else have that problem that has cats? It's crazy. Okay, so let's continue. Current maintenance can get 220s. Supplies can get 120. Laundry can get 120. Um, my cats can get 220s. Giveaways can get two fives and two twos. And the 2K challenge can get 200s. All right, let's, um, oh, gas had 160. So that can get 100 and 320s. I didn't put anything for groceries. My spending, I think I'm going to leave that in the bank just because, um, I don't know. I like to spend. <laughs> I, you guys, I've already bought myself a few things and I'm like, well, okay. So it's pretty much justified because my birthday is this Thursday and, um, I was like, okay, I'm going to buy myself this, you know, and this goes with it and that goes with it. So I bought myself like four things for my birthday and I'm going to say it's birthday slash Christmas for myself. Um, but yeah, I've, I've Christmas shopped for myself already. Has anyone else done that? Has anyone else Christmas shopped for themselves? Am I the only one that does this? I, I can't be the only one. I really can't be the only one. <laughs> All right. So groceries, I didn't put anything towards it. Spending 50, but I'm not going to pull it out. And miscellaneous didn't have anything. All right, let's count it up and see what I need to pull out from the bank. So in hundreds, I need three hundreds. So 20s is 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 24. Uh, fives, we need 2, 4, 6, 8. And for the ones, we only need 2. Wow, that's the lowest amount of ones I've ever needed. Okay, so, and I think that's only because I, I finished the 100 envelope box. You guys, I finished this box, and I promise, 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 I will be doing a unstuffing soon. I just haven't had a chance. I've been super busy. But I believe this week, I don't really have much to do other than work. Um, so this week, I will be catching up on videos. I will be catching up on listing everything I have to list and putting out that sale. And, um, yeah. I, I I will get everything done this week, you guys. So this is what I need to pull out from the bank. So 300s, 2420s, 85s, and two ones. And yeah, so I will link this story up um up at the end of this video. Just to, you know, if you guys want to go check it out from Annie Elise's channel, you guys can because um I just I don't know. Um I don't know. One, how could you do this to any child? Two, let alone your own child. And three, like, what is going through your head to think that your daughter is evil? I, and this, I think the girl was like three or four, maybe four or five, something like that. I don't know. I don't understand yet. I don't want to understand either because I don't know. But yeah, so I'll link it up that's pretty much all they have they interrogated her and that's what she pretty much said and i believe you know the father had custody of the daughter so they're not even sure how the mom got a hold of the daughter um 
so they're still investigating it so that's the little bit of information i have which is a lot of information all at once and um yeah so that's that's the little short crime story that i have um if you guys want to see more i will link it up top and yeah all right you guys so thank you so much for watching please make sure to like comment and subscribe and um i just want to leave it out there keep in mind you guys if you guys have nothing nice to say just don't say it at all it doesn't hurt to not say it all to keep it to yourself you know um there is no reason why we should be spreading negativity in this community at all and i'm just saying this just in general you know because just because <laughs> all right you guys so um i will catch you guys in the next video bye